It's so cold. Oh, it's so cold. Oh my goodness. It's so, it's so cold outside right now. <laughs> how do you all deal with the cold? I don't understand. How, how do you deal with the, the cold? It's like this chilly, freezing rain that's going on right now, and I just don't understand. How do you, how, how do you do it, Bobas? Please tell me your secrets. I know you got secrets on how you stay warm. <laughs> oh my goodness. It is so, it is so, so cold right now. <laughs> you know, I thought this, I thought these winter, this winter, um, asset that I'm wearing would keep me warm, but no, it does not, not at all. But hello, hello everybody, it's good to see you all. Welcome to my channel. I'm Mari Yume. And, uh, over in... The boba shop, um, there have been lots of, uh, cold, freezing rain, and I hate it. I hate rain so much. Ugh. Although, I would not trade the cold for the hot right now, because I know how hot it gets over here, and, uh, no, 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 thank you, no, thank you. At least I can bundle up a little bit. Hey, look, 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 look. I got fuzzy socks, okay? Look, see, I got, I got fuzzy socks. So, you know, that's something, right? I wish the balls jiggled a little. That'd be really cool, but I don't know. I might have to ask my art mama to separate that a little bit for me. I gotta ask her to do a lot of things. I'm, I'm so excited for when it's my time. Ooh, yeah. How are you all doing today, by the way? It's good to see you all. Are you excited? Are you excited? You know what today is, right? You can read the title, right? You, you, you can read, right? Oh, God. Oh, God. I hope you can read. <laughs> mm, I'm glad you like the outfit. These are free VTuber assets. I actually have them on um, on Discord. So if you ever want to uh, get some free VTuber assets, I have the ones that I'm currently wearing linked on Discord. So yeah, definitely. You know, feel free to feel free to check that out. You know, you know, you can check out that link right there if you'd like to join the Discord. But yeah, it's actually really, really, it's really nice. I love, you know, I couldn't get any special wintertime outfits. I, I know. I, I don't, <laughs> I don't have that kind of privilege. But, you know, free, VTuber, free VTuber assets are so, so worth it. Like, they are so, so worth it. You know? Yeah, the vanity link works again. I'm so glad. I'm so glad. <laughs> Yeah, don't sleep on the free assets, by the way. There are tons of free assets that you can find on Twitter right now for Christmas-themed stuff. And not only that, but artists work so hard to provide so many free assets. Personally, I would love to do free assets once sometime. That'd be so cool. Oh my gosh, if I could do something like that, oh, I'd be in heaven. Oh my gosh, JR Dragon! <laughs> Thank you so much for the coffee. That's so sweet of you. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Hold on. I took that a minute. Hold on. Let me, let me, let me check that out. Let me check that out. Yeah. JR Dragon 2006. Thank you so much for the coffee. That's. Thank you so much. You're so kind. You're so kind. Welcome in, everybody. Welcome. Hey, Corey. Hey, Aerith. Hey Yuki, welcome, welcome. Hey Jack, I see you all in here. I see my beautiful. Wow, who would have guessed I would stream on a Tuesday? You know, on a Tuesday. I, are you surprised? I wasn't kidding when I said, hey, I'm gonna really try my best to like, really go full time, like all in on this because you know, I, I um, situate financial situations have changed, so I can be on more and make more amazing content. And I know a lot of you want more live 2D tutorials. And I'm just like, okay, you know what? We can do that. We can go step by step through things. I really don't mind doing streams like that. Sometimes it's nice to just practice and have someone to draw along with, you know, a little drawing buddy. Also, Yuki, your progress has been going on really, really well. Like, dang, you're, you've been doing so good. Yeah, Momo has a YouTube. <laughs> Momo has oh bing bong. Oh bing bong.
Did you hear the doorbell just now? Did, 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 did you did you hear that? Someone's at the boba shop. I guess uh, somebody has a delivery. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. <laughs> yeah, it's basically boba. Yeah, Yuki, that's a really, really good point you bring up. Yeah. The bing bong. The bing bong. <laughs> I love that. It's Christmas. Are you all... Um, well, I know... Not everyone celebrates Christmas. Are you excited for just the holidays, the winter festivities and stuff? The presents, the presents, the gift sets. So what are you all gonna get from me? Hmm? Hmm? Where's my gift? Huh? 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 Where's, where's my gift? This is what I wanna know. Hmm? No good, Amy. Sugoku. Oh, oh, my stuffed animal? Oh, yeah? It's a corgi. It's a dog. It's a corgi. Now, my plushie, it's um, it's not a fox. It's a corgi. It's a puppy. A little, a little dog. Look at the toe beans. Look at the toe beans. It's a It's a Ooh, boy. <laughs> ah! <gasps> Mr. Game Changer. <gasps> oh, my goodness. Thank you so much for the $5 super chat. I really appreciate that a lot. Thank you so much. <sighs> That's really kind of you. Thank you. Thank you. I know I haven't even... I just wanted to chat with all of you for a little bit, you know, before we get to work and stuff. But thank you so much. It's really kind of you. Like, I really appreciate that. <laughs> Oh my goodness, my presence is the gift. My presence for all of you is this amazing, wonderful amount of streams. I'm going to be doing a lot of streams for um, the next couple of weeks because um, around the 23rd to the uh, 23rd of December to the 3rd of January. I will be on vacation. Mm, mm -hmm. So I'll be doing a lot of streams, and I'm try I'm trying to upload more uh, videos on YouTube. I haven't been uploading a lot lately, and I'm really sorry. I've just been super super busy working and planning on projects. So I'm hoping pretty soon I can start uploading a bunch of um, content. So I'm thinking while I'm away. I'll leave you all with some videos to kind of premiere and we can all watch together. I won't be able to stream live, but premieres are a really great way to kind of have all of us hang out and chat like this and still watch a video together that I made. And I can still be in chat and hang out with all of you too. Eto, kono inu no namae wa Momo desu. My corgi's name is Momo. <laughs> Hey, yeah, drawing, drawing is one of the toughest things, you know. I completely understand. Oh, I got a pretzel thingy. Oh, oh my god! Ding. It's really good. Mhm. Mm Pizza go is good, isn't it? Mhm. Oh! Oh my goodness! You're gonna make me choke on my pizza! Yuki! Thank you so, so much! For the $100 super chat! That is so kind of you, holy cow! I'll go ahead and I'll send you an early small Christmas gift. Since I'll be gone around January, I'll be going to my parents' house for Christmas and New Year's. This is going to be the, to the debut goal as well. Yes! Oh my gosh, that brings us even closer. <gasps> oh my gosh, maybe I can, um... Oh my gosh, that makes me even closer to my, um, the Funko Pops. So, for those of you who don't know, I'm planning on releasing these limited edition Mari Yume Funko Pops where it will be me and Momo-chan here drinking like bubble tea and stuff or like maybe like a sleepwear thing because you can make your own custom Funko Pops. And yeah, um, 
that brings us one step closer. Heck yeah, heck yeah, I'm so excited. I'm so, so excited. It'll be, oh my goodness, it'll be so freaking like epic. Oh, Lord Frank, thank you so much as well for the $5 super chat. Thank you so, so much. You're all so kind. Oh my goodness. Hey, don't, I appreciate it. It just brings us even one more step closer. I'm really excited for it too because I just, I want to release merch for all of you. Like, I really, I want to get a Momo plushie for merch. And I'm still trying to find a good distributor. I'm thinking about maybe, um, I kind of want to hit up either... Uh, what's her name? She's the one that does the Meowch plushes. Um, what, what's her name? Oh my gosh, Tasty Peach? I want to kind of either hit her up, maybe want, maybe she might want to do a collaboration. I mean, I don't think she knows my, in, in my existence, but, <laughs> um, maybe, maybe she might want to do a cool collab or like I could find a cool distributor that she uses, but yeah, I would love to have Momo plushies and then have, you know, Mari Yume Funko Pops and like, oh my gosh, I want to, I want to do some really cool merch, like something that not all VTubers do. Like I want to do something really unique and I think the Momo plushie might be really unique. I don't know how much, I don't know how much the plushie would be because it depends on the distributor, you know, like I, I don't really know a lot about that kind of stuff. So yeah, um, what is makeshift? I'm kind of curious about that. Mm -hmm. There are tons of free ways that you can totally support my channel, by the way. Please, I'm so thankful for the super chats and for people who join the membership, by the way, as well as the art commissions on my coffee. But, but please, please, please just know that you being in chat right now with me and watching my videos, sharing my streams, making fan art. I have live. I have I have hashtags. I do have um hashtags. I have, um, I have two, I have two hashtags. Well, technically I have three, but for my fan art tags, we have Neymuri, Neymuri Mari, and Mari's Dreams. Those are the fan art hashtags. So yes, all that stuff is perfect too. And I want to host all of your art on my videos too. Like I'm thinking at the end of each video, I can showcase people's fan art that they've been making because a lot of you have been making a lot of fan art and I'm just like, <laughs> <laughs> you're all very talented like you're all very very talented and I would love to showcase it on my videos so I'm thinking at the end of the stream I can show not stream um my videos that I upload I could showcase some of the artwork that people have been doing <laughs> oh that's really cool I'm gonna have to um look that up it's called it's called what again is make makeship makeship let me let me Google that. Make ship. Make ship. Oh, here we go. Okay, I will bookmark this for later. Thank you so much. Uh, I'm okay. Meow Strap. Thank you so much for that. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. There you go. You can become a VTuber as long as you can be connected to the internet. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. You know, you can even VTube without a webcam. And even without a microphone, because there's text-to-speech, and there are like some VTuber programs that you can use that don't require a webcam. So yeah, you can you can go all out. You just need some kind of device to stream, whether it be a phone, a tablet, a laptop, a desktop. It has to be something. It has to be something. <laughs> yes! I cannot wait. <laughs> Yes, no, no, thank you all so much for being so kind today. Ah. Now, I don't, I don't know of the programs that do live 2D models without a webcam. I don't think they've made anything like that just yet, but give it some time. I know you can do it for 3D models right now. Uh, I think it's called, is it called Wakaru? No, no, no. It's like, a, um, I think it's V Magic Mirror. That might be the one that you use that you don't need a webcam for. I can't remember. I looked this up a long time ago. I'd have to look it up again. But yeah, there is some that you can use without a webcam and stuff. It's very, very cool. But I do 2D stuff, so all of my stuff is done through uh, VTube Studio. Because I really like VTube Studio a lot. It's a wonderful 
it's a wonderful uh, nandake program. I and I really enjoy the uh, accuracy of the tracking. <laughs> so yeah, okay, minasan. Kyowa, nani oshimasu ka? What are we doing today? What are we doing today? Let me see here. So it is be magic mirror. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So I have a question for all of you. <laughs> hello, hello, hello. Welcome, welcome in everybody. Do you want to be a VTuber? But you don't have any money because you're a broke ass degenerate. Eh? Eh? <laughs> Hi, Mario May here. And today, I am going to show you how to make your very own VTuber avatar in the fastest way possible. <laughs> that is what we're going to be doing today. <laughs> so I hope you're all excited. I, I hope you all are, are excited. I'm going to be working on an art commission, actually. It's a live duty art commission for, let's see, for Nink. They sent me their reference sheet and I'll be working on their model today. And that's kind of what we'll go through step by step today. So the first thing you need to do to make your own VTuber model is Get a drawing program. <laughs> you know, get a drawing program. <laughs> Just in case you didn't know. <laughs> there are tons of free and paid art programs out there. So you just need to take two seconds to Google search them and start using them on either your computer, your tablet, your phone, or whatever drawing device you have. Once you got your art program, the final thing you need to do to become a VTuber is... Are you ready for it? Draw! Yes, it's really that simple. It's really that simple. <laughs> what program do I use? I use Clip Studio Paint, and that's what we're actually gonna be using for today. We're gonna be using Clip Studio Paint. I would like to eventually um, do some tutorials on 3D art at some point, that'd be really cool. My goodness what if you suck at drawing Ooh. how to get better at drawing hmm okay okay I'll tell you the secret on what you can do if you suck at drawing all right are you ready for this are you ready for this Practice. <laughs> no, 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 I'm serious, I'm serious. The more you work on a skill, the more you will improve. I kid you not, if I showed you what my drawings looked like last year compared to this year, you would think that some kind of kindergartner made it. <laughs> I kid you not, my old drawings from last year were not that good. But I improved a lot over the year. I just had to keep practicing, you know? The more you work at something, the better you will you will get at it. And I know it's kind of hard to realize that right away, but I like to do these little comparison charts of when I take my current work and then compare it to a few months ago. And I can see the improvement every time I do that. So yeah, just keep practicing. And every so months, 
take a look at your portfolio, see your progress, and you'll see a difference. Mindful practicing. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Maybe one of these, uh, one of these days when I, um, I'll upload this on, uh, as a video itself, I'll show you my old art. The old, the old art. Um, let me take a bite of my pizza real quick and, um, we can switch over to my tablet and, uh, start drawing. I got, um, pepperoni and jalapeno pizza. Mm hmm. -hmm. I was just thinking of, like, spicaroni. Spicaroni. Oh. Yeah, you'll definitely start to improve. You just gotta like compare, you know, of do not compare your art to other artists right now because that's just gonna make you feel bad. You can look at other artists work and get inspired and use it as like little resources, but you really shouldn't compare yourself to other artwork. You should really just compare your current piece to like your older pieces and you will see a difference. All right, let me um, set up my, my drawing pad here. <clears throat> Practice really is important too. It's, it's for anything, by the way, not just drawing. Like even if you want to learn Japanese, you gotta practice. I need to practice Japanese more. <laughs> I definitely need to do that. Mm hmm. Okay, so let me, let me, is it vegan pizza? Ah, sorry, what's up though? No, it's not, it's not vegan. I don't think Domino's makes vegan pizza, do they? Wait, does Domino's make vegan pizza? That'd be quite of interesting. Um, okay, let me upload this here. I need this reference photo because it's their um, art sheet. So I'm just grabbing Nink's reference photo that he sent me. Mm. Okay, let me, where is it? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Uh, hmm, Nani. Where did it go? Wait, I, I did upload it, right? Hold on. Okay, go to desktop. Okay. Oh, it's a U. Oh, I see it now. Okay, okay. You know, when you have too many icons on your desktop and then things just kind of... <laughs> I don't know, they just get kind of, uh, cluttered. Happens to me all the time. Okay, okay, so. Let me go here. I'm so happy that my stream appeared in your recommendation. That's good to know. Okay, let me see here, studio mode. Okay. Let us switch over. Bum, bum, bum. Yes. Okay, so... Let me... Can you hear the music? Actually, I'm not seeing that you can you can hear it. Oh. Oh no. Did I just make my OBS crash? OBS. 
Oh my gosh, don't tell me it crashed. I don't know if it's crashing. Or what is going on? Oh? Huh? Wow, I'm still going, huh? Yeah, OBS is freezing right now. Hmm. Oh, well. Well, I don't know what's going on with OBS right now. It's being a big dumb. It is being a big dumb right now. I can still see chat, though. I still see you all. I'm just eating pizza while I wait to, for OBS to stop being a baka. But it's being a baka right now. And I don't know why. Everything hates me now. Huh, okay. Might have to restart the stream. I'm so sorry. Give me one moment, I guess. Am I back? I hope I am. We are just getting to the good part. Oh, yes. OBS, why you do this? Am I? I am back. Yata. Okay, that's good. Tada, I am ma. Hmm. It looks like the music that I had is uh. That's what's making my OBS crash for some reason. I. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right, well, I guess, I hope it doesn't annoy you all that we are going to probably use my BGM. I had Christmas music. Actually, wait, hold on. I can do it differently. Hold on. I can do, I can do that thing. I, oh, I know what I can do. Okay, I know what we're going to do for music because I feel like it gets a little boring re-listening to the same BGM over and over again, so... I have this little playlist that I wanted to try out. Let me let me grab it and I will add it as a source through here. So we're gonna go to winter lo-fi. Winter lo-fi by Lo-Fi Geek. Lo-Fi Geek does a really cool, a really cool thing here. Mm-hmm. So what I'm gonna do is this. I'm gonna go into this studio mode. I'm gonna go add a browser source. Browser 2. Put that down. Take it in. Spin it around. Paste that baby in. And yeah. <clears throat> and then, well... It should work now. Alright, let's see. Let me know if you can hear it. Can you hear it now? I am the queen of scuff streams, by the way. But there we go. Okie dokie, let's see. Yatta? 
Okay, cool. Then that means I got it. I got it working somehow. Okay, no, it's this thing. I was like, what is that? And I was like, that's my overlay. <laughs> that's my overlay. I forgot what my overlay was. I forgot the source of my overlay. Hmm. Uh, don't worry. Don't worry about that. Okay, don't. Don't worry. Don't. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's really nice, comfy Christmas music. So I was just like, okay. Let's, let's use this. You know, something a little bit different, you know? Well, actually, it doesn't say Christmas. It's just like winter music. So, I mean, you know, there's that. Okay. Alright, let me see here. Um... Let me start with... Okay, so what we're drawing for the Live 2D. We are drawing Minx, VTuber, which you know what? I should probably put their name on my stream, huh? Yeah, I should, you know, be a good person, a good VTuber. All right, so why don't we add... Yeah. All right, there we go. Gotta be a good person. Good person. Oh, you know what? I should make it. I should keep it white. Actually, no. Wait, I don't like that. It's too. It, it's too. It, no. We'll go back to the other color. Go to like a dark color. Oh yeah. Okay. There we go. This is what we're drawing. This is their character sheet that they gave me. Which I'm really excited because, I mean, look at this cutie. Look at this cutie that we're drawing. I love the design. The design, oh my gosh, blonde. Gotta love the, the ponytail. How many ponytail uh, fans do we have in here? Hopefully you have quite a bit. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? <laughs> All right. <sighs> Let me see. Let me take some of my drink. Okay, so. I'm just going to be sketching first. Just to kind of go through the process. And I don't know if I'm actually going to be able to finish the whole live 2D model today. I'm going to try to get through as much of it as I possibly can. But, you know, if I don't. For whatever reason, then nandake. I shall have um, time tomorrow to do that as well. You know, you know. So yes, okay. Uh huh. All right. So we're gonna start sketching it out first. Can I have a shout out? <laughs> Can you subscribe to my channel? Maybe super chat. Maybe become a member. Then we'll talk. <laughs> Imagine that. Imagine that. Oh my god. Alright, let's see here. Mechanical. Okay, so let's see. We're gonna be drawing Le Circle. Thank you. Yeah, um, the little deer that's on my head is a free VTuber asset that I, um, that I found on Twitter. I have all the VTuber assets that I use linked on Discord too. And I post like a whole bunch of them. I posted a whole bunch of, um, of free VTuber assets that, um, if you want to have like your own little winter theme, you can also use them as well, you know? Oopsies. Okay. There we go. Uh, I'm going to be streaming for a few hours. I basically want to start the sketch first and then, um, I would like to start the line art. That's kind of my goal. It's to sketch and then do the line art today. That would be nice. Because, yeah, doing everything else, it takes a lot of time to draw a model. 
Like, it's not... Um... A very quick process, unless if you're drawing like a chibi or if you're drawing some kind of simple model. Okay, so I'm thinking of the idea to be... I draw very big at first too, because I just want the rough idea of like what I want to have done for this. So let me see, okay, if I do... do, 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 do. Okay, here we go. This is an iPad. It's, um, what is it, an iPad Pro? Yeah, it's an iPad Pro. And I have it connected to my computer through the uh, USB port C. And I just use a, um, a screen capturing program. It's really easy. You just plug in your iPad to the computer and it just screen captures it. It's really cool. So it's probably gonna have its hands like this, I'm thinking. Some kind of pose like this. Some some kind of pose like this. This is just a rough sketch of like the concept of the body portions. She's kind of tall, so I mean she got them long legs. Like, ooh. Ooh, yum. Okay, so. Yeah. Gotta do her justice. So let's see, it's gonna be quite a long torso. So that means from above this point here. And like I said, drawing just comes with practice. You know how many times I have erased and redrawn um, the my art piece that I've been working on? Numerous, numerous times. Like all the time, I'm always redrawing and then Erasing. This is kind of like the idea that I have for it. It's gonna be like... I always start with the stick figure type of thing, except it's more like a blob. But eventually, you know, it'll- it'll- it'll work itself out. So I think I should probably make... Let's see, if I'm gonna do her torso like this, then I think this needs to go up more. Just a, just a little bit, just a little bit. <laughs> Aww! <laughs> oh my goodness! You don't know them. Aww, how do this go? Thank you so much for this super chat. You know, I... Uh, I I believe if you do your best, you'll be fine. Like, people will like you for you. You know, like, I really appreciate that a lot. Like, thank you. Thank you. I'm, I'm so glad. Like, <laughs> thank you so much. It's like, nah. It's gonna take some time. Mm-hmm. It can, it, can, it can take some time, you know? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, oh, Yuki, it depends on what time you're streaming. Just because I do plan on being on here tomorrow as well, so it really depends. But <sighs> thank you so much for the super chat, Aiko. I really appreciate that. It's really nice of you. I, I really appreciate it. Yeah, it's going to be a very chill day today. <laughs> um, of us just drawing. Mm, we're just, uh, mm, how do I say? We're just kind of trying our best. Wait, why? Why? Why is he, Why do you respect me so much? Why? <coughs> Sorry, one moment. I was choking. On air. On air. There we go. There we go. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Konnichiwa. Hanami-san. How are you doing today? Welcome. Welcome. We are just drawing our best. 
Where is her... Okay, so she's got a little bit. She's got a little bit of... Yeah. She's got a little bit. A little bit. What are body portions? <laughs> uh, what are body portions, right? Am I right? What are body portions? Oh, God. Anatomy is hard. Women, women intimidate me. They're so curvy. <laughs> oh. So we're gonna be taking lots of lots of skirt stuff here, and then jacket stuff here. Uh -huh. I am really surprised that all of you want me to draw so much. Like it just it blows my mind that you all just really believe in my art abilities because you know even i don't consider myself to be like the greatest artist in the whole wide world like i give kudos to the people who do art full time because there is just no way i could do it. it is too stressful like drawing full time is really stressful so i i have a lot of respect for people who um who can draw full time Mm -hmm, mm hmm At least that's just how I kind of feel. <laughs> I can speak a little Japanese. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I, I really want to study more of it. Mm. It's just hard to practice because I have too many things going on all the time. English is just hard already. English, English is hard. And then we have bows here. I know this looks like a big scribbly mess, but trust the process. Like I said, you can get better and better, and then you can get better and better and better and better. You know, there's my little base right there for that, and better and better. So, yeah. Trust in the process, okay? Trust in the process. <laughs> oh, kawaii! I love Nekugatayskides. I love, I love cats. I love cats. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, am I really? I'm glad I can make you want to start drawing. That's all. That's all. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Thank you. I like my free. I like my free assets. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, there are a lot of um, free language uh, websites that you can use. That is true. E pointo desne. Mm. Yeah, there are a lot of helpful, like, people who are at so many nice people who are willing to, um, to help. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. san Issho ni nihongo o benkyo shimashou ne. Glad. <laughs> yeah. Mm, mm hmm. Mm hmm. I'm glad to hear that. Yeah, there, there's lots of people who are so kind to teach, and we just need very patient people in the community. Wait, that, okay, yeah, that is with a thumb. And that is, okay. Don't mind my, my scuffness. My scuffness. But yes, trust in the process. That is the best way to get stuff done. At least that's how I feel. Plus, I always draw bigger than how it really comes out at first because I'm trying to get like more of the anatomy. Because I'm still drawing. I started drawing last year. So I'm no expert. What kind of ear? Okay, no, no. It's like this. 
This is actually a really well done um, character sheet by the rough idea of everything. You know, I'd say something kind of like this with this. Okay. Uh huh. And then having some kind of glove right there. And yeah. Okay. 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 So that is kind of the idea in terms of body portions. I'm going to keep working on that, of course. Take some time. It takes some time. Let me take some of my drink. Okay, okay. Yeah, taking your time doing things is so important. For sure. And don't worry if um you've been late. I had to restart the stream anyways because it had crashed on me. <laughs> oh. But yeah, I'm using Clip Studio Paint. It's like Photoshop and Procreate's child. It's like their secret love child. And I, re I really like this program a lot. Okay. Let's work on this face a little bit, huh? Let's like actually make a face. Hmm. Okay, so why don't we do this? What I like about having Clip Studio Paint on the iPad is how customizable the app is. It's super customizable, which is really nice too. Okay. Okay. Oh, see, a lot of pe a lot of artists have their own ways on how they have their art process. Mine is just a mess. Mine is always a mess. Like, what are what are folders and separation of everything? Like, who who has time for that? <laughs> Am I right? <laughs> Stuff is difficult. I just think it's important to focus on the concept first. I do things a little bit differently, I know. Imagine using just clip art. That'd be pretty nuts, huh? Ah, it's a free VTuber asset. Um, mm -mm. the little reindeer on my head and the um, little, uh, what is it called? Like a little sash? A free VTuber asset. Mm. Um, I commissioned my V- my VTuber model, so I have her credits in my bio. Her name is Moeko Peach. Um, she's a Japanese artist, and she is a wonderful, wonderful artist. She made me so cute! I did the rigging, though. Um, so yeah, she is super, super talented. Um, you can find her on Twitter. I have, um, her- her, uh, Twitter handle in my bio. You could totally start drawing with like a pencil and paper. That's totally reasonable. Like that, that is reasonable, I think. Especially since you could always skip.
Ooh, hands suck. I hate, I hate hands. Um, it took me like a month to rig my model. It's not perfect, for sure. But yeah, it took like a month. There's some things that I would like to fix on my model. So yeah, uh, I would like to do that eventually. That would be nice. But of course it's not, um, it's not necessary right now. Let's see, let me look at the hair again. Oh boy, okay. This is so cute. Oh my gosh, you have no idea how much I am totally gushing. Like, can we just talk about how this is a heart? This is a heart right here, a heart, a heart right there in the bangs. That's just totally, it's so cute is so cute um you can get a brush that's similar to the liquify effect in clip studio but i'm not using the symmetry tool right now because i'm just sketching there's no point in me trying to be try hard over a sketch because i need to see if they even approve of the sketch before i actually go into like line arting the moment i start to line art that is when we go try hard and we become a little sweaty with the symmetrical tool. That is when we try hard. But right now, it's not necessary. Ah, okay. Besides, it's good practice to not use a symmetrical tool because when traditional artists would start to draw, you can't, what are you, how are you gonna, you know? Well, okay, hold on. There's photocopies and then you could just flip it over and then put it over a piece of paper. Okay, look, there's ways you could do it in traditional, but usually people just kind of eyeballed it, you know? Speaking of eyeballs. Speaking of eyeballs. Speaking of eyeballs. Uh, okay, so she's got some, like, she's got some, like, mmm. Hi, honey. Kind of eyes, you know? Like, look, look at her, look at her. Hold on, let me, let me pull her up. Look at them eyes. You're gonna tell me those aren't some high honey eyes? Like, she was just like, hi, honey. That's what I imagine. Listen. Listen. I am very appreciative of VTubers. I like all of them. <laughs> um. I can wink, but the problem is if I try to wink, I might sneeze. I might sneeze. It's very dusty in here, and I got dust in my eye. Plus, every time I look down at my, um, on my iPad, I, my eyes are closed. You know what, Popas? I'm so talented with drawing. I can draw with my eyes closed. I'm literally drawing in my sleep right now. Look, look at this. Look at me go. Look at me go.
do the weirdest things like <laughs> I kid you not. Okay, here's a story for you. I literally got a DM the other day. Okay? I literally got a DM the other day of somebody saying some really rude things to me and then they're like, "Yeah, I don't care if I'm harassing you either. Enjoy your your crappy streams." And then they're like, "I hope you rot. I hate you." And then I bl I blocked them. And you know what? I haven't thought about it since. Until just now, while we were talking about the bad things people do. <laughs> I haven't thought about it since, but yeah, I just blocked him and I, I moved on. So that's now on Twitter. There's a bunch of clowns. <laughs> bunch of clowns. Mm. Yeah, there's a lot of, there's a lot of dumb people a lot of dumb people you know you know just send them to the void just delete them like how monica did mm. yes yeah, symmetrical tools will save you a lot of time yes if you're dry and you're in vtuber model use a symmetrical tool it will definitely save you a lot of time just you know remember remember that you don't have to use it just yet especially if you're in the sketching phase Ah! Ah! No! Oh! Yes! Oh! 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 You? Yeah, there you go. And then you go all you do you- you pinch it. You pinch it. Pinch it. And then you bring it down and around town and pinch it again. It's like a Dorito chip! That's how I draw things. I think of them as a food item because I like food. Truly, should probably. And this hair bow just reminds me of a potato chip. No, not a potato chip, a Dorito chip. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, people, if you have time to bully, then you got time to be making content. Oh my gosh, there are so many Yukis. Uh, oh my gosh, drawing with a mouse? <laughs> You'd be super talented. You know, I've seen um, speed paints of people on YouTube drawing with a computer mouse. And I'm like, I'm like, whoa, boom. my mind just goes boom. And I'm like, Sugoi, this net, Sugoi is so freaking cool. I don't know, those kind of people are on like another spectrum. If they can do that, they are on like, I don't know, they're on some kind of like spectrum there. I'm just like, whoa, they're just, they're too talented. They, we don't deserve them. They're, they're too talented for us. <laughs> oh, da -da -da. Oof, 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 oof. Okay, so why don't I do? A little bit like a little bit of Monica in my life. A little bit of Monica's all I need. <laughs> you know that song where it's just like it's just Monica it just keeps saying it. I don't know why that's suddenly stuck in my head, and I'm sorry if I just got that in your head. I do that sometimes. Ah. Uh... Okay, so they wanted. My stuff is a whole mess. You know, Gacha's been getting a lot of popularity I've been seeing. Although I heard that it's starting to kind of die, but um, there are a lot of like, believe it or not, there's a lot of tutorials on Live 2D using Gacha models. And it's really intriguing on how they do it and like their process of that. Like I find it so intriguing. That takes some serious talents. At least I think so. Mm -hmm. 
but I think it's pretty uh, legit, you know? If it works for you, then, I mean, by all means, go for it. Who cares what anyone else says? People want to bully just to bully because they have a hair across their butt and they're just like, well, my butt, my butt, they're like, my butt crack is itchy and I can't scratch it because there's a hair there. So I'm going to take out my agitation on this VTuber for no reason. Well, like I said, people will just find a reason to be mean and be hateful because they got too much free time. You just gotta not give those people any attention because that's all they want at the end of the day. People, like, even in here, like, the other day, I kid you not, the other day, I was talking about how if you join... By the way, ahem, ahem, let me, um, let me, uh, mention this. If you join my membership here on youtube you get special access to um a role in my discord and you get access to the special um chat that i have for members only you get to watch all of my videos um that i upload a day early before anybody else and you also get to vote and um you get to vote all of my stream ideas that i have for the upcoming week as well as video topic ideas and i plan on doing like member only streams where we all game and like have members night and i kid you not i had like three people in chat being like um not everyone has money okay some of us are poor you should be more sensitive about people's financial situations Ugh. and i was like whoa Whoa, 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 just a minute. I never said you had to do that. It's just an option if you wanted to. There's tons of free ways to support your favorite content creator. But you know, you don't got to be a little baby man about me wanting to give incentives to those who do want to support financially. It's not required. But if you are going to do it, then I'm going to have some nice perks. And there's nothing wrong with that. So yeah, people will find ways to try to like shame on you no matter what. It's, it's quite interesting. Imagine getting mad that your favorite content creator is like, yo, I have perks if you want to come support me. It's nuts, right? It's nuts. The gacha community seems pretty strong. I don't know a lot about gacha. Um, gacha. Hmm. Nandake. Gacha wa etto. Hmm. How do I explain what gacha is? Because I don't really know a whole lot about it myself, other than I know it's like those character dress up games. Yeah, it's like, um, it's kind of like a chibi model, model, a uh, dress up game. This that's kind of how I could describe gacha. Sorry for my broken Japanese. Yeah, yeah. You don't have to get an expensive model either, though. That's the thing, too. Like, you know, if you got the time to draw your own model, then you can totally go for it. You have to think of it this way. What are you willing to spend for your model and for your, even just beyond VTubing, what are you willing to spend for your live streaming career? Are you willing to spend your money or are you willing to spend your time? Because if you don't have money like me, then you have to spend a lot of time on making everything yourself. And that's perfectly fine. Not everyone wants to do that, though. Some people, they want to save themselves on time, so they end up spending money. But yeah, you have to kind of figure out, like, what are you, what are you willing to spend? Are you willing to spend your money or your time? So you got to, like, you know, choose one of them. And then go from there. You know? Mmm. Is it, like, pit crew? Mmm. Um. Uh, hmm. Chotto 
Yeah, it's kind of like pit crew. Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah, you could always start off with a reactive PNG too, just to kind of see if you even like streaming. Some people want to get into this and like they, they shell out thousands of dollars for this super expensive model. And then they're like, I'm graduating after like a month because they realize that streaming is really hard. It's not easy. It's really not. It's not like something that you can just do and expect to blow up overnight either. And that's kind of another misconception a lot of people have. They think that, you know, you'll blow up overnight just magically. Like, you don't have to put any other effort other than to just go live. And that's not true at all. There's so much things that you have to do in order to um, be successful. And I know it's hard, too, because you probably see VTubers debut and then they, like, blow up. And they're just like, oh, my gosh, like, they're just so awesome and amazing. Like, how do they get so... You know, how do they get so successful? Like, how, how on earth do they get so successful so fast? And you don't realize that a lot of these people who appear to be super successful like that, they are successful because of a few reasons. One, they had a following on another platform that they brought over to their streaming and that they had been hyping up for years. Two, they have connections with people behind the scenes. Like they have a very large influencer group. Like say like a bunch of their friends are all content creators and they're very successful. So they shell out their community onto them. Or three, they work for some kind of corporation or management that has a huge marketing team to promote them as a content creator. No one just goes live and has like a bunch of people flooding over to them. It takes a lot of work and a lot of um, smart planning. You have to be smart about it. It's not about how hard you work. It's about how smart you work. Why is my music suddenly not... I see. It's like, what was that? Okay, there we go. I was like, what is going on? I was like, what is that? <laughs> but those are the three ways of how someone gets... Mm, Mm, so, 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 so. Etto. Chikanto. Okane. Ga. Uh, let me see. How do I want to say that? Uh. I want to say, is it like, uh. Chikan. Like, which one do you think you'd be willing to spend more time on? Like, your time or money? That's just what you gotta make up. It's what you gotta decide. You have to do, con you have to make content that people actually want to watch, you know? Like, I'll be honest, you know, I have ADHD. You know how hard it is to keep my attention with things? If you are a content creator and you are able to keep my attention, then good, good job because I get bored so easily. So, so easily. It's like painful. Boredom is so painful <laughs> for people with ADHD. It's a, it's a feeling I can't really describe that accurately because it's just, I don't know, it's just pain. But, um... What's nice about having ADHD is how creative you can get, you know? Um, I do have the pro version of Live 2D. They had a discount on the, on the membership because if you buy it in bulk, you can get a nice discount. And if you're like a, a student, you can also get an even bigger discount. And it's really nice. It's really nice. I need 
to draw the 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 opi. The opi. Why are they so difficult to draw? There we go. There we go. I need to lower them down a little bit. They're like, uh, actually, no. No, I like, I like that. I like that. There we go. You can get like a, um, a free trial of the pro version. And I think it gives you what, 42 days or something? I can't remember. That was a long time ago and I didn't even use it to the full extent. Like I got the free trial and then never touched live 2D ever again. Just never touched it. And I was like, well, I wasted that. So yeah, if you're gonna redeem the free trial, make sure you actually plan on <laughs> using it. To its full extent. Otherwise, yeah, you're just kind of wasting it. Don't be like me. Don't be wasteful. Don't be wasteful. Yeah, some people, when they get bored, they just space out. That is completely reasonable, I think. That's why you're, you just gotta ask yourself, okay, first of all, if you wanna make content, ask yourself this, what do you like watching? Do you like watching Mario? <laughs> I'm, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Well, I hope I hope you like watching me. <laughs> but do you like watching gaming streams? Do you like watching art streams? And you know, once you like figure out, you know, what kind of content you like watching, ask yourself this. Why do I like watching videos from this one person? What about them makes me really enjoy their content? Maybe they're really funny. We all know that's not me. Pfft, no, we all know me being funny is out of the question. Out of the question. But like, think about it though. Think, think about it. What about that person, you know? Makes you want to watch their stuff more often. Whoopsies. You can do numerous sketches for this, by the way. You don't, this is, this is still like, a very, very rough sketch of what I'm going for for this um, model. I'm so excited I never get to draw um, females for uh, VTubers because um, the only um, models that I've drawn were both male. So I'm, this is like my first female model and I'm like really excited. I get to draw. I get to draw the boobas. Look at that. I'm just like. It's not like, listen, it's not like I'm enjoying this. It's just, I just, I just, it's good practice, okay? It's really good practice. I need to draw more women. I need to draw more women. I need the practice. I was told that women's bodies are like pears. So I have to try to draw like a pear. It kind of does look like a pear if you think about it. Or like an hourglass. Ooh. Hourglass. Eh, yeah. Makes a lot of sense, I think. I had such a busy day today. I was so nervous about stream. Not gonna lie, I was really nervous about stream. Uh, you're funny, just unintentional. That's true. That is true, yeah. I'm only funny when I don't try to be funny. If I try to be funny, it doesn't work. I just act like Michael Scott from The Office and it's just really awkward and cringe. <laughs> so it's always best that I just, I just stop trying to be funny. And then it works. Uh huh.
Uh, what are legs? What are legs? I don't know. I have no idea. I still suck at feet. Feet are so hard. Okay, I need to look up a foot reference right now. Excuse me one moment. Um, let's see. Let's go to Pinterest. 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 Okay. Um, oh yeah, you sent me a nyata. Okay, um, anime girl feet drawings. All right, how do I draw a foot? I suck at feet. Why are feet so hard? Why can't feet just be easy? Why can't, why can't? Yeah, I don't want to look at the toes. I just want to look at the shoe. Show me. No, I don't want to look at toes. I want to. I want. Ooh, these heels, though. I want the pumps. The pumps would actually be best. But these are all like side profiles. I want like a front facing one. Gosh, I spend hours looking at references sometimes and <laughs> I don't always get what I'm looking for. And sometimes I really have to search to find a good reference. It's so hard, you know? Mmm. Yeah, exactly. I do want to have experience. Hey, I mean, if you break it down into shapes and that helps you, beautiful. Beautiful. That's all that really matters. Uh, huh. Oh, here we go, here we go. I think I found, oh yeah. Oh yeah, I think I found the monies. I think I found, okay, I'm gonna take that over. I think I found the monies. I'm trying to find my eraser. What did you do? Did you like, lo did you lose it in between the cushions or something? Or like under your bed? Like, that's a little sussy. Oh, okay. Well, why don't I? Okay, you know what I should look up? I should look up anime girl in heels. Oh, honey. Oh, honey. Those are some nice heels. What the heck? There are some really nice reference images you can find online. Anime boot references. Ooh, that actually might be what I'm looking for. Actually, hold on. Anime boot references. Thank you, Pinterest. I love your automated recommendations for me. For me. Mm -mm. Is it under your pillow? Hey, I'm so glad. See, you just gotta keep committing and, you know, taking breaks when you need them. And yeah, you'll get there. Eventually. Eventually. Oh, I found my I found my heel reference. Okay. Okay. Alright. Ooh, I like these. You know what's crazy? A lot of the best references that I have found online are the ones that uh Nandake. Are the ones that are um are drawn on a pencil and paper. Those are like some of the best ones I've seen. Okay, so I think I wanna go with this reference here. So, why don't we combine this a little closer? I want to make that a little bit closer. Which means I need to make this thigh kind of go out more like that. And then this needs to kind of go in there more. So yeah, this is kind of the pose I'm thinking of, you know, just get that nice juicy looking thigh right there, you know? 
um, in order to like... So I think a lot of you are getting confused on how I'm using my iPad. So I have the app, Clip Studio Paint, installed on the iPad. So even if I wasn't streaming this and I was like upstairs on my bed, I could still use this application because it's on my iPad. Now, in terms of streaming what you're seeing on my iPad, because this is not showing you what's on my computer. This is showing you what's on my iPad. I am using an uh, application called A PowerSoft iPhone iPad Recorder. That is uh, what I'm using. But this isn't like me streaming from my, uh, like this isn't showing you this right here. This is not my desktop. This is my iPad and it's the application in my iPad. Just in case if there was some kind of confusion on that. Oh, okay. Okay. I un uh wakarimashita, wakarimashita. I understand. So okay, you're gonna be leaving soon then. There'll be a VOD. Etto VOD ga arimas. Um there'll be there'll be a VOD. So you you can watch it later. <laughs> uh. Etto Okay, you have a good day. You have a good day. No, this is not my uh, computer. This is my iPad. And then I stream it to my computer. So it's just capturing what's going on my iPad. If that helps clarify things a little bit. nice beautiful leg just saying of course I'm definitely gonna have to redraw this because I'm not good at heels clearly <laughs> that's okay though that's why we got many sketches many sketches to help us Kind of like that. Yeah, because I'm going to reposition how a lot of this stuff looks. Yeah, okay, this is coming out pretty nice. We did like a gaming stream the other day. Um, I know a lot of you missed it, but we did do our first gaming stream on here. It was really fun. I have it listed in my playlist, so yeah, yeah. So let me see. Uh, it was actually a lot of fun too. We played, what was it? Big Brain Academy. Yeah, that's what we played. Yeah, 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 yeah. And we donated money to charity for um, Team C's. It was awesome. Yeah, you will have a, um, anyone who has to tune out, it's totally fine. There'll be a VOD later, so. You don't have to worry. You don't have to worry. Wow, we have two meows in the chat. I like that. That's really cute. <laughs> All the meows in the chat say, yeah. That's great. I love it. I love it. I love that so much. It's so cute. So cute. Uh... 
You know what? Screw it. I want to do this instead. Screw it. We're gonna, we're gonna do this instead. We're gonna do this instead. There we go. Drawing just takes a lot of time. And patience, too. Like, I drew this a certain way, and now I'm like, no, I'm just not feeling it now. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, I do want to do another Big Brain Academy stream, though. I need to get my rank up. Hmm. Oh, you like my style, really? I mean, <laughs> we're just in the sketching phase so far. But I appreciate it nonetheless. Hmm. Okay, this is kind of like, you know, where we started and then where we are now. I'm hoping with more practice, I will be able to get better at drawing body proportions a lot faster. I'm really slow with stuff. Like I said, some artists, they're able to just zoom, zoom, like draw stuff so fast. And I'm like, Ugh. I, I like, wa I watch the tutorials of them doing it too. And they're like, yeah, you know, we're gonna, we're gonna draw this for right now. You're like, we're just gonna make it look like this, you know? And yeah, right there, right there. You see this, you see that? All right, you got the, you, you know, you got the back heel right there already. And then, got the rest of the the rest of the shoe yeah right there and then you know for me it looks like this but then in the in the video they got these like beautiful like you know soles going on in the shoe and it's like completely detailed and i'm like what the heck they're like you know you just gotta add you know you do the start of the rough sketch and then you add detail and i'm like mm, bro you need to you goody good as you go a little slower please i have a baby brain Okay, I can't process that much information. What are you hiding? What are your secrets that you're not telling me that you edited out from the video? I know you've got secrets. What are you hiding? But yeah, um, that happens. One tip that I learned though is to draw, um, is to not draw so closely into the, the tablet, which I make that mistake all the time. It's hard not to, though. Like, it's really hard not to. But yes, I'm very guilty of, of that. In particular. <laughs> like I was doing earlier. And I have to constantly remind myself to just, you know, zoom back out. You got your drawing to close to the screen. And it's messing you up right now. And I'm like, you're right, Mari, it is messing me up right now. Team Mari. <laughs> yeah, weird things happen in the boba shop all the time. Sometimes you just hear really weird sounds. You know, like sometimes, you know, Momo barks. And yeah, you'll just, just hear weird things all the time. So if you draw too closely to the tablet, it skews your um, proportions and your perception. That's the idea, because when you're doing traditional art, you wouldn't be that zoomed in on a piece of paper. So in theory, you should have an easier time drawing if you zoom out. And like, you can zoom in if you're trying to do like special details, especially with, uh, what's it called? Especially when it comes to um, like coloring or something, and like eye details, but for the most part, you shouldn't be, um, drawing too close, because, yeah, it definitely skews your perception, and it happens to me all the time, too. Uh, okay. Uh, let's see here. 
put... See, look at that. I'm already drawing the foot better now that I zoomed out. <laughs> it's already coming out a lot better. Um... Oh, let me see. Yeah, some art tutorials, though, I don't get them. Like, they're just... I don't know. They're on another planet or something. You know what art style I really liked? I like... I, I don't know. I kind of miss some of the 90s art. You know, like the Sailor Moon, like the original Sailor Moon. I always thought that art style was super pretty. That's just my opinion. My personal opinion. I just always... I don't know. I thought those types of styles were super, super pretty. There are some artists who actually specialize in that. And uh, it's just so cool to see. I would love to one day, you know, take a little crack at it. Maybe try to draw me some Sailor Moon type of art. But yeah, um, that, that would be the dream one day. What if I... Okay, what if I do this? So sometimes when I'm having a struggle to draw something, instead of drawing the way it looks, I try to draw around the negative space. So like kind of the space that's around it and base the proportions off of that it's really hard to explain but instead of actually trying to draw like the foot you know like that it's like what's around the foot you have these little in-between spaces and you draw that shape instead and sometimes that kind of helps me a little bit when i'm when i'm struggling like right now The 80s art style, yeah, a lot of it is very fluffy. That is true. That is very true. Yeah, we gotta really appreciate art, you know? Like, there's just so much good art out there that people just never get to discover because it's so hard to find artists sometimes. I struggled so hard trying to find an artist for my VTuber model. Because Twitter has a terrible search engine. And it's not like you just go on YouTube and be like, artist for hire. Okay. Like, yeah, you can go on Fiverr. But, I mean, that website is kind of sketchy. That website kind of sketchy. Just a little bit sketch. So, yeah. Uh, I don't know about that. Well, you know what? This is starting to come out a little bit better now. Let's do her hair. Let us do her hair. She's got these really pretty... It's like a ponytail, but it's a ponytail that somehow splits. So. We're gonna take that. And then from here... We'll take these. I think I want to kind of have it come out like that a little bit. So yeah, yeah. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> you saw a guy, really? That's so cool. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. I'm going to the store with like these crazy hairdos and stuff. Wait, did I accidentally... Ah, uh, where'd you come from? Like little boogers. We don't like boogers. Okay, so now we can start to do this. Okay. Makes it a little bit easier to see because I'm messy. <laughs> I am very messy. <laughs> Kind of gives me a little bit of, like, that Jesse vibe from Pokemon, you know? Kind of gives me a little bit of that vibe. Let's see here. Um, her hair would be, like, you know. Probably going up like that a little bit. Coloring might also help just a tad. 
got some long legs. Let's just put it that way. She's got some... It's a... It's a progress. <laughs> it's progress. <laughs> it's progress. You, um, what's it called? What's it called? <laughs> Not okay. I'm trying to remember. Mm. When it comes to VTuber model art, you draw everything separately. But this is just a sketch phase, just to get an idea of how this is gonna look. Hmm, so... <clears throat> I need to look up a skirt. Anime girl's skirt. I literally look up a reference for everything. Don't listen to, like, artists who try to tell you that. They're like, oh, I can just draw from imagination. They're lying. They they couldn't draw from imagination, at least not in the beginning. They're just, they're lying to you. Even, like, the greatest artists still use references. All the time, all the time. But yeah, there are discords that um, do help artists find other artists. The only thing is that, like, you know, you need word of mouth for that, you know? Like, a lot of that is something that you have to be recommended because you can't really Google easily, oh, Discord for artists. Like, that's not really useful. But yeah, there are Discords that are like that. You just gotta know someone who's in it. Um, okay, so why don't we... But you don't even need to type in his name. You could just literally go to discord.gg slash live2d. Okay, now I have to erase these parts. So it comes like that and then Oh, look at that. We're drawing the skirt. Oh my gosh, we're drawing. We're drawing the skirt. Holy cow, look at that. We drew a skirt. We drew a skirt. Oh my gosh. Look at us. Look at us. 
Look at us. We're so proud. So proud. This skirt. Your skirt. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Look at that. We learned. We learned. And this is the skirt. Proud. Proud. I have um, more references like on my computer screen that I'm looking at, so that's what um, that's helping me <laughs> quite a bit. So yes, references are definitely important. Um, okay, there we go. There we go. told you there's always weird noises that happen in the boba shop sometimes you hear animals making noises too like sometimes you hear popper and you hear momo my cat and my dog you never know what kind of noises you might hear on stream that's why it's always important to tune in because who knows what's ever gonna happen i feel like you all focus on the weirdest things too like i don't know why you're so fascinated by it me, I don't care. I'm just like, I'm just vibing. Just vibing. Drawing a cute skirt. Mm hmm Cute skirt. Let's go. Let's go. It's starting to come together. It's starting to come together. Which makes me happy. So why don't we okay so this part here is gonna be interesting so it's like uh what's it called it's what's it called she's got kind of like this corset it's not really like a corset but it kind of feels like a corset it's like this i'm using clip studio paint and I draw this on my iPad. Let's see. Yeah, it's kind of more like that. Yeah, let's go, let's go. Okay. Okay, so, never really drawn something like this before. This is very, very new to me. Kind of like a poker top. Yeah, that's kind of what it reminds me of. It's like a poker top. Yeah, you have to make you have to make everything into clothing. Clothing is so hard. So much drawing and erasing. But that's okay. That just means everything's gonna come together at, at some point. <laughs> You hope, right? You hope? <laughs> Let's see here. Mm. Okay, so now we got these little... I don't know what you call these. Like, what kind of clothing is this? Uh, what kind of knife? Kind of like these? I don't. I don't know. It just—it just reminds me of like a lottery kind of thing. Like you're in a casino. It's and it's like she's casino chan. She's casino chan. Let's see here. You know what I love about doing art streams? I get a ton of people who come in will spam the same question like 30 times until I answer it and then they leave. Only to come back to spam another question 30 times. And I think it's funny because <gasps> even if uh, you learn something right away, sometimes seeing the process of how something is done 
actually is more beneficial. Because I used to have that kind of mindset too. When I would go into a streamer's room and be like, what microphone are you using? They'll be like, oh, an Elgato Wave. And I'm like, okay, bye. And then I, I have no idea like if an Elgato Wave is even actually good for me or anything like that. I just got my one answer and then I'm done. I'm gone. Which is always interesting to me. Is this a star? I think it is a star. Oh, so you know what that means? Then that means... Ooh, look at that. Fancy. 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 Uh -huh. Yeah, people do the weirdest things. Like, I don't know. I read everything in chat. And there's a specific reason why I don't acknowledge certain things. It's not because I didn't read it. I always read everything in chat, just I don't feel like responding to it. And you know what? That's okay. Even when you're a streamer, or a VTuber, like, or just any content creator, you don't owe everyone a reply. And that's kind of something that a lot of people who are new to content creation struggle with a lot, and then they get burnt out and get a lot of anxiety. People are ruthless. They will eat you alive on stream, and they do not care. They do not care. Because they everything's about them. When that's not true at all. It's not chat stream. No. It's your stream. So, you know, why are you having so much anxiety turning on that live button? Why are you so scared to talk to people? Is it because you've had bad experiences where people are like super demanding and pushy? And they're just being super rude and it just makes you anxious. And like people don't realize the way that they talk to someone online really affects that person a lot because they just think oh well you just turn on your your stream and then you can just do whatever you want and it doesn't even matter but it does actually it really does some people are really rude and entitled it's like going to um a restaurant or some kind of um store and you know like those really obnoxious people that's like oh, i want to talk to the manager about this really dumb policy that well, I mean, they don't- your typical worker doesn't have any control over. And like, complaining and freaking out when they tell you, well, it's policy, and then making the person who works there feel bad. It's a very similar concept. That people don't realize that they- they do. I mean, I talk about some really like, serious stuff, and like, some people just don't want to hear that, so they leave. And I'm like, okay, bye then, I don't care. If I listened to the three most loud and annoying people on Twitter telling me what I'm allowed and not allowed to do as a content creator, then I would have never started my YouTube channel. I kid you not. I had a lot of friends who would tell me, Mari, you should start a YouTube channel. You know, like, you'd be really good at it, and you should make videos. Like, you really enjoy talking to people, and you enjoy making content. And I just didn't for six years. Six years. I, I just didn't. Because, you know, I was just afraid. I was afraid of people just constantly yelling at me and flipping out on me and um that fear it really delayed me um from becoming a vtuber and like doing any kind of content creation i was just really nervous and yeah like i said you get like the one person who's like you suck and i'll be like you know what true but what do i suck at specifically and they're like i don't know you just suck they don't actually have any constructive sort of criticism they just say that just to hurt you it'd be one thing if they're like oh you kind of suck at keeping your audio level stable and you'd be like oh okay so that just means i need to learn how to use my microphone like all right bet okay i, I can learn to do that like that's constructive i can learn i can learn 
But yeah, if it's not constructive, then yeah, they're just doing it to just be a jerk because, I don't know, they're salty or jealous at your success. There we go. And that's okay because, you know what? Haters make you famous. Haters make you famous. Uh, 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 uh. Haters make you famous. Uh, 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 uh. So, yeah. Uh huh. Let me stretch. And hello, welcome everybody that's just tuning in. I feel so bad about people like who want to start streaming and then they're scared because like, I don't know, people are afraid of like getting yelled at and you know, you can't stop everyone from being rude, people are gonna be rude no matter what. But you know what you can do is set yourself up for a more positive environment, you know, like setting some ground rules, being like, no, I'm not gonna say whatever weird things that you want me to say just because you asked. And no, I'm not going to give you a shout out just because you asked in chat. Like, no, setting ground rules is so important. It really is. And that just takes time. Actually, wait a second. Does this go all the way up? Mm -hmm. I might need to ask. I might need to ask on this part right here. Because this part is a little confusing based off of the character sheet that I have. So, I might need to ask on how they want that drawn. There we go. Ooh, wait, no, 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 wait, wait, no. That's not how I wanted to do. I want to do something. Okay, kind of like this. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh huh. We are slowly chipping away at this gigantic, uh, this, uh, what's it called? On this sculpture. We're slowly carving out our beautiful model. Slowly by surely. <laughs> you stream for the first time and someone told you to get off the internet? Like, you see what I mean? Like, why? How dare you, Choco Milk Tea, stream on my internet? How dare you? <laughs> Like, some people are so bananas. They're like, why? Like, why are you going to be so salty? I don't know. Just some people are. They got too much free time on their hands. And, you know, instead of them making, like, their own content and being productive with their life, they're like, no, I'm going to go. I'm going to go online and I'm going to I'm gonna tell this person to get off the internet. That'll show them. Oh, yeah. That'll, that'll show them as I wipe the Cheeto dust off my hands to go type my insults in their chat. <laughs> okay, let's see. Alright, now we got the boobas going right there. So, you know what? I think it should be more like this. Yeah. Okay. There you go. There you go. How dare you be so adorable? You know? <laughs> and yeah, some people just, I don't know, they so they'll see like a new VTuber. Like sometimes when I'm streaming too, I get people who come in here and they'll be like, you're ugly. And I'm like, what do you mean? Hello? What do you mean I'm ugly? Excuse me? Excuse me? What about me is ugly, huh? Is it the glasses? Is it my mustache? What, what about, what, what, what is wrong with my glasses, huh? Huh? What's wrong with my glasses, punk? Huh? You wanna go? I'd be like, you wanna go, punk? You wanna fight me? Look at me. Look at my, look at my glasses. Yeah, you got a problem with my glasses, huh? What, my nose too big for you? Hmm? Hmm? Well, what about that, huh? I'll have you know I have fuzzy socks on and they keep me very warm and you are just jealous because you just want to touch the fluff in my ears and you can't, you can't, mm-hmm, that's right. <laughs> like
like I said, some people just want to hate just to hate, you know? Gosh, okay. Okay, let me see. I might only be able to do the sketch today, actually. Don't worry, tomorrow we're still going to be drawing more. So hopefully I'll be able to get more of this done. But so far the sketch is, um, it's, 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 it's getting there. Kind of gives me a little bit of Phantom Thief vibes too. Then again, I am obsessed with Persona, so I mean, you know, there's that. <laughs> I love me some Persona. Persona's so cool. Kind of wondering if I want to do like a different arm pose, you know? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. See, it's it's starting to come along. A little bit. A little bit. It, it's starting to come along. And you know what's crazy? This this is still like a super super rough sketch. Like I'm basically going to take this, lower it, and then make a new layer and draw over it again. Maybe it's the nose. Maybe it's the nose. Hmm. Yeah, people will definitely notice your passion. That is such a good, uh, oops, observation. Do not save. I pressed the wrong button. <laughs> Ignore that. Uh, let me see. Let me... Yeah, I actually really like how this is coming out. I think if I do another clean... Nandake, I think if I do, like, another clean... Sketch, I can actually have like a more finalized sketch. So, yeah. Mm. But oh my gosh, I've been drawing for like uh, two and a half hours. Ooh. Yeah, if you're not that talented with. Um, if you're not that talented with drawing, you can totally use Vroid Studio, make a 3D model. You can always start off with a 3D model too. Mm hmm. Chut, I'm gonna see my drink. I lied. I also took a bite of my pizza. <laughs> I cannot believe. It is taking me two hours to eat half of a pizza slice. Well, it depends on what kind of animation you want to <laughs> oh my goodness look three charms thank you so much for the super chat i'm sorry i got so excited i breathed really heavy and i started choking <laughs> i love the keep it up that's so kind of you thank you so so much it's really kind of you thank you thank you Slowest pizza eating record ever. Basically, yeah. Um, no. If you do it in Vroid Studio, it's already rigged for you as a 3D model. You can make it from scratch, but then, yeah, you'd have to add the bones and, like, rig it yourself. I don't know anything about 3D modeling. I am not the go-to person for that. But in terms of 2D... Yeah, you do need to, um, cut up all these pieces. And then, um, you animate them in live 2D cubism. Oh my goodness. Okay, let me see. Um, blah, 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 blah. Ooh, let me see. Um, yeah, um. There are tons of free ways to support your favorite content creator, you know? I do want to work on this more, but like, uh, I can only spend 
so much time <laughs> on drawing because yeah you can't be drawing for too 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 much you know i'll be streaming the same time again tomorrow but yeah it is um it is pretty late and stuff and i do want to work um okay so here how about this i'll give you all a choice either i can end the stream now and then we continue more drawing tomorrow or i can stream a little bit longer but instead of drawing we could i don't know maybe play a game there is this game that i've been kind of thinking about wanting to start i kind of just wanted to like try it out but yeah i mean i don't know then again my obs is being kind of weird so maybe i shouldn't stream tonight anymore it sucks too because look i have this game it's called super auto pets and it's a free game it's very similar to like tft and i have been wanting to play it for like a whole like two weeks now and i haven't been able to play it because i haven't found a good reason to play and i just want to i just want to play cute little pets <gasps> patrick ug oh thank you so much for joining the boba club yes i get the game boss Thank you so much. It's so kind of you. That's so kind of you. I just, I don't, I don't know what's going on with my OBS right now. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much though for joining the Boba Club. Let me, let me check something real quick. Okay, yeah, there is something wrong with my, with my Elgato capture card. Ah, oh, it's just not working right now. I don't, I don't know what happened. But yeah, it's being like really weird. And I, I think the only way I can fix it is if I restart my computer, which is uh, not the most, you know, reasonable. It's not the best thing that I want to do right at this moment, you know? <laughs> so yeah. Yeah, um, it's, um... It's like evening time. It's like a six for me, you know, dinner time, basically. But I am happy with the progress that I've done so far on this model. Uh, huh. Yeah, we got a, we got a lot of work done, actually. Yeah, I really wish I could do more streams. Like, you know, I want to do super long streams at some point, but um, I might have to update my OBS. It could be doing that. Sometimes it doesn't tell me. It doesn't tell me that I'm... Nandake. That it needs to get an update. And I'm like, oh, I'm just gonna start my stream. Just hide it. And then I start it. And then it's like, bing, bing. Oh, no. I am um, smooth-brained. And I'm like, you little baby brain program. How dare you? How dear you not work for me and then you start to mess up and then you crash and then i have to restart you like three times and then i get a blue screen of death well actually i don't get blue screens i get like these black screens where it just and then my computer just restarts and i don't know what is going on with that either like it's so weird like i just i want my computer to just work <laughs> this computer is kind of old it's like four years old it's like four years old yeah, I'm having pizza, actually. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, um, let's see. What pizza am I... Oh, yeah, I'm having pepperoni and jalapeno pizza. I got a free coupon for... No, wait, well, wait. Coupons are free, Mari. <laughs> look, look, look. I got a coupon for a free medium to topping pizza. And I was like... Free food? Oh, yes. Oh, please, the free food. <laughs> So, yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, wow, you're all in different time zones, huh? Oh my gosh, let's go. Let's go. You like my long neck? I work really hard stretching it to have a long neck. Like, you think, do you think this is just, you know, this is not natural at all. Like, this is not natural. I have done things to myself to have my neck this long. I need to re-rig my model, <laughs> but I'm lazy. I don't want to re- I don't know. I think it's hilarious. I'm part of the giraffe squad now. Yoink. 
Listen here, listen, it doesn't have to be perfect, okay? I mean, look at my neck. My neck is not perfect. That's a mistake that I made um, when I was learning Live 2D. But I know better now, you know? You know? I know, right? Saying a VTuber is ugly is basically insulting the artist and that is so, so rude. Like, why would you do that? You're not gonna go to a restaurant and be like, mm, you know, this food, actually, you know what? This food sucks. <laughs> I don't even like this food, but, 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 but sir, you ate like half of it. Well, you know, it wasn't that good, but you know, you were taking so long that I just, uh, I just, I want a refund. And, and I kid you not, people at restaurants do this. They're like, oh, you know what? I'm gonna eat like half of or 75% of this dish and then say I don't like it and I want a refund and I'm just like what the heck what the heck why you be like this and then there's me who's just so anxious to even like a comment about how about how I just I'm like uh uh I don't know I don't know um the food's a little over salty, I guess. And I'm just like, no, 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 no. How do you? <sighs> well, I think it's different if you don't like your own model, but then that means you just gotta go get a different model then, you know? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I love my model. I love how I look. I am cute. I'm cute. I'm cute. Hey, 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 I'm cute. I have a tummy. I have a tummy and I'm automatically cute. Not only that, I have fuzzy socks. Yeah, I have fuzzy socks. That's right, what do you think about that? Mm-hmm. I have fuzzy socks. And I'm, that makes me extra cute. <laughs> okay, let me see. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see. Listen, this is the dream realm. Sometimes you may see things that are... Interesting. Sometimes you see things that are interesting. <laughs> but never fear, okay? Never fear. <laughs> I do think I'm going to... Definitely be uh, ending though tonight. I'm gonna try to see if I can just kind of relax. I had like a really long day today, you know? I guess just, I just wanna go lay down in bed. Like you have no idea. My pizza's cold. It's raining outside the shop and um, it's not even like the comfortable rain. It's like that icky, cold, like nasty kind of rain. I'm like, ah, uh, No. It's like, no, no. I mean, um, there's like a meme of me online. Uh, Nandake, there's a meme of me online of, uh, of somebody photoshopped eye doves, uh, measuring my neck. So, I mean, that could probably give you a little bit <laughs> of a reference, you know? You know, it's actually really difficult to set up chat for YouTube streaming, but I did it through Streamlabs. It was the most easiest way um, that I could figure out how to do it. At least to get it customized like this, but there are ways that you can get chat to show up. And you know, um, what's it called? What's it called? And make it look, you know, transparent. There's like some tutorials on YouTube. They're kind of hard to find, but yeah. But there yet, yeah. you can find them. Hmm. Well, right now I am. What's it called? Oh, right now I am working on not one, but two live 2D model arts. And then I'm working on a live 2D rigging. And yeah, those are kind of like my projects in terms of art. 
In terms of YouTube, though, I do have some very interesting projects that I will be working on for, um, for YouTube videos. I have so many things that I want to do, but I don't have all the time. Like, I wish I had more time to, like, do all the things. I don't know. I don't know. But, yeah. Um, I'm pretty excited to start working on new, um, uh, what's it called? To new projects. It's probably just the, um, special font that I am using. It's, like, a, supposed to be similar to Pokemon. But, yeah, sometimes it can be hard, um, to read. I'm, I was thinking about switching my font to the other thing I was using before I was using this one. Because I have, like, a different, um, chat font for it. I just haven't... I just haven't had the time to do it. I'm a little lazy. Uh, lazy VTuber syndrome. <laughs> I just want to nap and be cute and comfortable, okay? I just want to relax. I just want to relax. Well, I'm just wearing VTuber assets, like... Ta-da! Oh no, my clothes have come off. They have transformed into something different. Oh no. Oh wait, they're back. <laughs> It's just free VTuber assets. I just plop them on my model and I rigged them. It's so easy to swap out clothes. Like, I don't know why everyone has to go and spend all this money on like brand new fancy outfits. Like, you really don't have to. You can just get free VTuber assets, put it on your PSD file, and then throw that into Live 2D Cubism and just make sure you rearrange all your files. And then, yeah, it just re-export it with the, with the new um, layer. And yeah. It's that easy! Is that easy? Oh, Nink! I kid you not! We were working on your model today. This is my progress so far. <laughs> it's very, uh, sketched and scuffed. It, look, 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 look. This is not the finished project. product. This is just my idea of, like, a pose. I also thought maybe I could kind of draw the arm to like, um, I, I was also kind of thinking about maybe drawing the arm kind of like this, where, you know, you have like a pose like that, so that way it's not going to be super basic. Yeah, you're basically rearranging the texture atlas. <laughs> if I had the money to go 3D, I totally would. But yeah, this is kind of the progress that we were making today. So yeah, um, I am working on it. I just wanted to like let you know since you know you just tuned in. So yeah, 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 yeah. But yes, okay, let me see. But yes, I am actually ending right now. Tomorrow I'm gonna work more on your model link. Um, I did have a couple of questions about your model. I'll send you a message on Coffee because yeah, there's a couple things that I wanted to ask about the design just to make sure that I am drawing um it accurately because yeah, I want to make sure I'm drawing I'm drawing you accurately. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but I'll send you that like, you know, after stream. I want to I want to eat my pizza. Like I want my pizza. It looks so good. I want to eat it. I want to eat it. It's so bland. But yeah, I am gonna head off now, everybody. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So you all have a wonderful, wonderful evening. I appreciate it. Make sure you subscribe so that way you can keep an eye on when I'll be streaming tomorrow. We'll be playing more live 2D art. And you know what? Maybe tomorrow we can actually start line arting. Yes! Let's do that. Let's do that. Mm -hmm. But okay, everybody, you all have a good night. Okay, I'm gonna go eat and I'm gonna go relax and get comfy. You always like comfy. If you ever wanna come hang out with me on Discord, the link is in my bio. Thank you all so much for tuning in. Ah, Mina-san, kiowa, awari desu. Hontoni arigazaimashita, totemo tanishikata ne. It was so much fun, thank you so much. I appreciate it. No, I'm gonna eat the cold pizza like a true VTuber. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm probably gonna reheat a little bit. I am a little cold, so yeah. Uh, thank you all so much, everybody. I appreciate it. <laughs> yes, thank you all so much. Bye, everybody. Have a good night and take care, okay? Bye, everybody.